Hello, this video is going to demonstrate how you can use the VO Analytics and the new VO Player Moments features. First, in order to use these features, you want to make sure that you're logged in. You can tell you're logged in if you see your initials in the upper right corner. After a game is recorded for your team, you'll receive an email, and when you click on that link, it is going to take you straight to the game footage, but you won't be logged in. So to see these features, you'll want to make sure you're logged in. Now, when you're on the VIA website, you have some navigation on the right-hand side, and the top option is VIA Analytics. When you click on that VIA Analytics, you're able to get lots of data, such as possession percentage, goals, shots. It's going to have comparisons to prior games, so you can see how the stats are tracking. Uh, if you scroll down, you have a link to an analytics studio, but you have lots of stats here that are pulled out from the game, passes completed, possession percentage, lots of different information. You can get pass strings to see how many passes the team was able to put together at a time, uh, heat maps, lots of different information here in the analytics portion of VO. You also have the option to go to different clips so if you click on clips and then you hit filter, you can filter for game moments. So one typical one is goals. So if you go there, you can click on goals to apply that filter. And now if you click there, you'll get skipped right to the goals of the game. If you're looking to see what went well or perhaps uh, what didn't go well in that moment. The other option, and this is a, a new feature in VO Analytics, and that is the player moments. With the player moments, uh, the AI scans the player jersey numbers, and if you click on a moment, then it's going to show you the moments just for that player. So you can see here it's detected 5 minutes and 44 seconds of time in which the goalkeeper had the ball. There's 31 different moments. You can toggle forward and back between those moments here. You do have some settings you can adjust with this. You can adjust uh, the proximity of what it's going to pick up as a moment, depending upon how close the player needs to be to the ball. Uh, you can adjust the time on the ball, and you can adjust the time before and after that moment uh, in regards to how long that is. Uh, the final thing I'll highlight real quickly is here at the bottom, you have the option to open the timeline. If you open the timeline, it's going to show you some more data, such as the match momentum. Here it has all these events that you could get to earlier. And if you click on an event, it's going to take you right to that moment in the game. If you have any questions about how to use uh, the VO platform, please don't hesitate to reach out. Thanks, and have a great day.